Jokic is probably statistically, when it comes to overall game, the worst MVP winner. He is the worst MVP winner in the last 40 years. Why do you say that? When you're talking about MVP, the guys outside of first and second place, their teams was first and second place. The people who won the MVP, their teams was first and second. When Jordan won it, his team record, they were seventh in the NBA. That year, he averaged 35, 6, 5, three steals. All-star MVP, defensive player of the year, scoring title, steals leader. That was the MVP. Historic year. Makes sense, right? That makes sense. When Westbrook won it, his team had the 10th best record. Triple-double. Right? Time, since Austin he Robinson did, he, he did something amazing. His team was 10th, but he was he did something that wasn't done since Oscar Robinson. When Jokic in 2021, Jokic's team was fifth. He averaged 26, 8, and 10. What was the historic part of that? There was no historic. Oh, the big man almost had a triple-double. Let's give it to him. That, that's what the, 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 the narrative was. A big man almost, not did, almost won the triple-double. And they gave it to him when his team record was like that. His second MVP, his team was tied in 10th place. 10th best record of the NBA, 27, 8, and 13. What was historic about it? The two people before him had amazing, uh, 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 an amazing season 